What's going on guys? Steve again from RC Tanks and Trucks 24-7 here with the new RC car and it's another FMS awesome little RC crawler. It's a 118 scale Toyota FJ Cruiser. Now 118 scale, small but mighty. I love them. Here's one here for example. There's a new Rock Hobby Fire Horse 118 scale as well. Hard body. I'll leave the link in that if you want as well. There should be a video coming up for that very soon but they're awesome little cars. Injected molded body Full functioning hood, scale interiors, multifunctional light system, high traction tyres, one inch internal bead like wheel, realistic pin and ring gear axle, high torque transmission, high torque brush motor, 7.5 volt 2S LiPo, chassis mounted servo, aluminium chassis rail and tune coil shocks. Awesome. But yeah, like, uh, like this one here, the fire horse or Jeep, exactly the same thing. So. They are great little cars and I love the packaging with these. They're always awesome. They come in a nice little foam box. I had to use my other hand to help out, but there we go. Structure manual up top. You have your battery and a charger and a little four-way wrench. <laughs> look at this. And they look awesome. Check it out. Wow, it has a bit of weight to it as well. But doesn't that look great? That looks super, super detailed. FMS, there's their stuff, I don't know, in my opinion, some of the best stuff at the moment for scar realism and just, you know, like even, like I said, the hard body, I love that. I love it how it's not Lexan. Like this is well, that's the fire horse, but yeah, you can tell it's a Jeep, definitely. Same scale, but uh, different manufacturer. Check out that. Put it down quickly. We'll have a look what else we get. A bit of foam, that's mad. Here's our 2.4 gigahertz controller. Nice design. You can easily drive one-handed with this, steering trims, throttle drill rates, all those extra buttons, LED buttons and stuff, I'll show you that in a minute. But yeah, I've had these on the other cars, uh, like that one there, the little Jeep, which is probably one of my favourite RC cars at the, at the moment. It's just so small, but so uh, detailed, the same thing, just there, so awesome. But that's a 112 scale, this is a 118, so... Let's have a look at the car itself. I'll do a separate running video for these because I don't want to keep them too long, these videos. Awesome little tyres there, not foam filled, but they do look sweet. Tiny little lock nuts holding them on. Really nice details. A lot of things are separately applied. And it does have a full interior. As you can see in there. And at the back as well. So just check out that. Like not, Some 110 scale stuff doesn't even have this. Roof rack, spare wheel that's functional, does have LED lights, full like um, guarded underneath, so it's got like your mud guards and everything, so it mitigates kind of water and dust getting in there and mud, but obviously you can still get everything wet if you really try it hard enough. But we got four link suspension at the front, does have a pan hard bar there as well, awesome, chassis mounted steering servo. All links at the back. Awesome looking pumpkin design. All plastic. Have a little ladder there on the top, on the side, sorry. Your mirrors. Snorkel. Everything looks cool. Look at those front light. They really hit it on the uh, the nail on the head with the design, haven't they? I think it looks fantastic. Got to mention, you got your telescopic drive shafts, front and rear, and uh, friction dampers. So no oil in these, but I'm pretty sure, I'm sure there'll be like aftermarket stuff. That'll be available soon for these uh, to upgrade because they're such they're so popular on the market now. Lift up this bonnet. Look at this. I love these. Check out that same thing. You know, small but mighty, but it got everything in there. You know, it's crazy. There's your lipo battery, and this one does come with a spare battery, so it's a 7.4 volt, 380 milliamp hour, 2S, 5C. And you got another one in here as well. But there's all the brains, on off switch, your multifunction like ESC and receiver all in one. But uh, yeah, I love how it's got that little hood. It's awesome. I keep saying awesome and how good they look, but they do look great. They look, they look like a model, but it's an RC at the same time. Even these, like, you know, look at the uh, side steps here. It looks exactly like the real thing. So let me get some uh, batteries in the controller and I'll power this up and let's uh, give it its first little test. Okay, now what's cool about these models, they have 
multifunction like LED lighting system which is really cool and on Depot when you plug it in you turn left and right the blinkers light up doesn't have any blinkers at the back but it does have uh, brake lights or reverse lights in one so what you can do on the controller it's got this multifunction button it's A and B mode so you can put it in in slide it over to B, in a, B mode and when you push this LED button you can see now it's changed to no lights push it again it'll have the like headlights and the blinkers as well push it again high beams same thing push it again you'd have like the hazards push it again it'll just go back to what it was when you first plugged it in pretty cool so you don't want any lights you can just have it like that and even the uh, paint at the back lights go on but everything else is off but I do like it I like the high beam ones I think that looks great what else you can do with this one if you have it in this B mode as well you can adjust the steering angle so the steering angle can be adjusted if you push this angle button here I'm going to do it on camera you'll notice how steering it will change so that's the lowest setting a bit more oh sorry lowest a bit more and that's max so that gives you like a maximum throw that's it apart from that that's it show you the low speed running try as slow as we can go the ESC is a little bit uh, loud but it's okay. so the slowest we can go is that noise is normal they're all do this so pretty good crawling not bad speed when you think about it you know I guess it's you know scale like really if you really want to put it that way we'll put it on the ground I'll show you how quick it goes alrighty here we go I love those lights. Do us have a running video because a lot of a lot of people don't watch the whole video, so you know, you know, they lose, they just lose interest. So no point doing long videos as much anymore because people just don't want to watch them all. But uh, yeah, what do you guys reckon? Links are down below. I think it's a great little car. Definitely not just for outside, but you know, indoors, especially with these uh, pandemic times. Nothing beats these. So really cool. Hope you enjoyed it, guys. Let me know if you have one of these already, and uh, let me know what you think about it. Cheers, guys.